Hello and welcome to another Langer Property video. I'm Richard Edwards. Today I'm in this stunning wine town, in fact Barola wine town of Serra Lunga d'Alba. Just look at this place. Serralunga is one of the 12 Barolo towns, which means it grows the Nebbiolo grape, but this can be produced into Barolo. And this makes it very special because Barolo is called the king of wines, the best wine in the world. And the house I've got to show you today is a small house. It's just 165,000 euros, two bedrooms, but is right in the historic center of the town here behind me. And this town dates way, way back. The castle dates back to the mid 14th century. And it's a really beautiful, calm place. Tourists love coming here from all over the world. And so if you're looking for something as a, a place for yourself and maybe to rent, this could just be perfect. Now the house needs some light restoration. I'm not going to say it needs the walls tearing down, but, it, but you'll see, it needs a repainting, maybe some plastering, refitting kitchens, bathrooms, etc. But it's a two bedroom house right on the circle of the town. And I think you're going to like this one. I think it's a real investment because to get anything in any of the Barolo towns now is very difficult and it's very expensive. So this one is quite special and unique. So let's take a look and then we'll meet together again afterwards and talk about the, 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 uh, the, the house and also about the area. So here is the exterior of the house, this yellow house here in front of us. And it's two floors, plus there's a cellar below. So let's take a look inside. And as we can see in the doorway here, the entrance, there's a stairway directly in front that leads to the upstairs to the bedroom and the bathroom. We'll come there in a moment, but let's take a look at the ground floor. And here we have this, uh, this living room and it's, uh, it's very badly illuminated at the moment with just one light bulb, but uh, it, you know, it's got great potential. It's a nice room. Uh, I'll put the measurements here. And very strangely, there's a WC here. Um, and a laundry, but uh, I think I would be kind just to put that as a laundry, but that'd be up to you. But at least the plumbing is there. And then we can see this is a window that overlooks that, uh, that incredible historic street that we've just seen. And then back through, we come to this little archway and we have the kitchen area. And you can see everything needs doing. It needs retiling, it uh, needs repainting, maybe some re replastering. And it would be interesting to see if a window could be fitted here. Certainly in the roof, it looks like something could be done there, a roof light. Um, but um, it's a nice place, uh, you know, in a very important uh, Barola wine town. So always would have potential for rental. There's electricity power supply there, and we can go upstairs. And here we have this uh, area here, there's a balcony, we'll come to that in a moment. So here's the bathroom, and you can see it all needs redoing, uh, but all the plumbing is there, so it shouldn't be too major to do this. And then if we just swing around here to the left, we come into the first bedroom. And again, it's a good size. It's a decent double sized room. And uh, over a view over the uh, this, this incredible walkway, this ancient walkway around the town.
back in. If we go to the right, we go to this probably slightly bigger. My wife just did the measurements, but uh, eh, probably about the same size. Uh, sorry, we, ha we haven't got that window open there, the shutter, but um, a nice amount of light will flood through here. The ceiling is, is relatively low, and, and again, it needs everything doing. It needs, uh, the, the floor's not too bad, uh, but it needs some plastering and some painting. And there's also a beautiful view out here. Let me show you that from the balcony, because again, these shutters are a little bit rickety, and I think the owners are not too keen to open all of them. But you can see you've got this beautiful view over what is now the most expensive real estate in the world. The last Barolo vineyard sold for 4.3 million uh, euros per hectare, I think it was. Um, because they can become so much value, so so valuable. So you've got a mixture of vineyards and uh, hazelnut orchards here. So it's a beautiful place. So that is the house. You can see it's not big. It's not going to cost a fortune to restore, but it is in a prime location. So I am absolutely confident that this one is going to sell very very quickly. There's a neighbour. <laughs> People are very nice here actually. I like the people of Lange, very open, very relaxed. Um, re really, really nice. So, so there you go. That's uh, so one more quick look around just because we can, because it's so easy. Okay, so what we have here as well is another room. What well, in Italian is called the cantina or the cellar. And it's just a, a room underground that you can store your wine collection or food or junk, <laughs> which is what they often get used for. So it needs a good clear out. I mean, look at that television. It needs to be in a museum. But uh, the living room is above us and uh, it's very sound and actually it's very dry in here i can tell you that uh, it doesn't have the feeling of dampness at all and it's very the temperature is just cool you'll find that it always stay the same temperature i promise you this one will sell very very quickly because the price is good and to get anything in a langer area now is extraordinary Just while we're here, let me tell you a story I heard about this place from the owner. It's a Central Storico and it's a fantastic restaurant. Uh, it, the food is fantastic. He's a great chef and he's a really nice character. And he was telling me that one evening that Sting was here dining and um, Sting loves Barola wine and he used to come here often. I, I don't know about now because he, he has his own vineyard in Tuscany, but um, he was here and the owner of the restaurant, he's a really, uh, crazy guy and uh, he, he said ah sting i've got your latest cd let me put it on and uh sting like okay okay and uh, he put it on very loud and uh, it was about half past 11 at night and one of the neighbors probably all of them got a little bit upset about this and so they called the carabinieri the the military police and they came in and they came in and said what's all it? oh and they saw Sting sitting there and they didn't know quite know what to do. But anyway, it was a great story. And uh, they said, oh, if you, if you could just turn it down a little bit. But the, uh, the owner of the restaurant was telling me it was a, it was a fantastic moment, one of those classic moments. And uh, um, it really shows what important place this is. Um, it, uh, it attracts all kinds of people because it really is a beautiful place. We've just been talking to tourists up here from Austria. And Austria is a beautiful country, but they were saying how much they love to come here. So. Let's get on with the video. Okay, so that's the house. If you have any questions, by all means get in touch. We have great local builders and architects that can help you bring this house to something, something really beautiful, something practical. And like I said at the beginning, it's a great property for rental. So if you just want a few weeks a year here and then to rent it as well, we even have people that can look after that for you as well. Now I wanted to end today's video on, on a bit of a sad note, especially for us, um, our, our beloved uh, golden retriever, Sky, he died on, uh, on Sunday morning. 
Um, it seems he ingested some poison when we were out walking and, um, and, and he died very quickly within 36 hours. And um, the vet did offer us a plaque uh, that we could have a remembrance somewhere, but we knew we'd always feel bad about not visiting it. And so I thought, you know what, in the next video, I want to give him a mention because it was my plan to start bringing him into the videos because he was a beautiful, white, very smart, very loving golden retriever that we love dearly. And so I just want to give mention to him here and show you some video and pictures of his very short, but beautiful and effective life. So thank you so much. Uh, I, I've already had so many wonderful comments from Instagram and, and my clients uh, from the past writing me the most beautiful messages. So we really appreciate that because, because you know, if you're a dog lover, if you have a dog, you can only understand that yourself, how close they become to us. And, and this dog was very, very special for us. So thank you for all your support. Look forward to seeing you here. Uh, and if, you, as I say, if you're interested in this property, just get in touch. But here's a little tribute to our beautiful dog, Sky. Thank you.